here at Rexall Pharmacy. The pharmacist tells me they stocked up on amoxicillin anticipating this shortage. And while it's not affecting them here quite yet, they are keeping an eye on things as we move into the colder months. A shortage on the shelves is nothing new. This time, it's amoxicillin, an antibiotic used to treat bacterial infections, commonly prescribed to children in liquid form due to its sweet taste. Uh, there are also some other antibiotics that can be used, such as penicillin, but it doesn't taste as good. Sometimes making it much more difficult to convince a toddler to ingest. The amoxicillin prescription does tend to go up in the winter with all these other viruses that are infecting kids as well. RSV cases are on the rise nationwide, and while amoxicillin is not prescribed to treat RSV, RSV and other viruses cause upper respiratory infections, which can lead to bacterial ear infections in children, for which amoxicillin is commonly prescribed. And there we go. Thank you very much. I still have some in stock, but I definitely am seeing all the wholesalers are out of stock. Not affecting us currently, but it's something that we're aware of. Dr. Forrest says there are some alternatives. Specifically, the liquid amoxicillin is the shortage, uh, but there are some chewable capsules that can be used. As well as capsules that can be opened and sprinkled into food. If the capsules are available, we could always tell them to pour out the little sprinkles into applesauce or ice cream or something else that people can drink or that kind of thing. According to the FDA, there are multiple factors that can go into causing a drug shortage, such as quality and supply issues and increased demand.